Hey guys, it's been now. Uh, welcome back to Hexen. In the last part, we went to the cave, but we didn't go into the swamp. Now this swamp one is... I probably... In my actual playthrough, I don't think I actually cleared this swamp. But it's because I can't really find where to go. I definitely... No, oh yeah. You start off in the water. You start off in the water. Whose idea was this? Whose idea was it? <laughs> hey, look, we put the play in the water. We're apparently rushing. Oh, dude, what? You can go in here? Dude, I didn't know you could actually. Oh, crap. i to get my butt kicked because I'm. Ah, oh, crap. Uh, quick use that. Ouch. Oh, there I go. Alright. I didn't know you could actually jump down in there. Well, I'm not actually gonna jump down in there now. Oh, dude, there's freaking. Yes, freaking swamp guys still in there. Oh, well. Nice pit! I said that on my first day. It's nice pits! <laughs> that is actually really weird. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for saying that. Dang, guys. Um, annoying guys, I can't remember their names. But I grabbed some cool stuff. I didn't know you could jump down here. I'd always play the stages. Anyway, note how there's. Oh, they're down there. They're down the level. Oh. Is there another? Yeah, there's a third one. Or maybe it was the second one again. Uh, but anyway, so this, um. Yeah, it's a swamp level, you may as well expect it. Uh, so basically there's three different... Oh, there you go. Uh, so you've noticed that there's three masks thingos that we've got to grab. And there's... Oh yeah, there's guys in like each of these. It's so annoying. There's tons of like the annoying enemies. The swamp guys, the... These guys, these are the swamp guys, the guys with shields. Um... So anyway, I'll, I'll finish my se sentence. Um, there are three mask things. Each of those mask things corresponds to a direction on this. You can progress. The water level will lower on one of these, where you can progress, depending on which one you put in. I don't know which one goes where, to be honest. I think one of them... Like, I, 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 know, I know we'll be able to figure this out somehow. I think if we go in here and we actually start clearing out these guys, because I definitely know, I also know that you can, you've got to go into like a teleport in the ice map, I actually think, and that's how you get around the back areas of this place. Whoop. Also, yeah. How annoying is this? I'm trying to just go on my merry business and you got this guy just going meh, 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 meh. That one died easy. Oh, there's two of them in here. It's on. Oh. I'll take on this guy. Oh! Well, there's one mask. Also, you see a star on the map? Um. By the way, these things are kind of weird because you can see that there's a little bit of a break. Them? I'm not 100% sure why there's a break in the fence, specifically. I'll do the swamp guy back. Yeah, swamp guy back. Dude, what ha why are the swamp guys spawn? Alright. Basically, you're never safe. Basically, those guys will annoy you the entire Oh, gosh, there's more of them. See, this is okay for the fighter, because the fighter just goes up, punches him. That's it. <laughs> That's it. Oh yeah, turns into the pigs. And then you kill them! <laughs> I know, it's, it's weird. It's 
weird, especially because that one special. I sneezed on my screen. Dang it. Um. <laughs> hands off the mouse. Just sneeze on the screen. Gotta, gotta wipe. Also, yeah. Do you see how constantly being shot at? Yeah, that's gonna that's gonna be so much fun in here. You know why? You know why? You stand, you stand in here. And you attempt to kill several of these guys. What? A ducks? Oh, I used one. I, I didn't. I didn't realize I used one. So that's pretty bad. This is this is just growl, growl. Yeah, there's guys on like each level of this. It's so weird. It basically does prove that you were supposed to jump in this game. I don't know. Just playing on. By the way, these guys don't go down levels specifically, so it's good news for you. Oh, there's one of them. Flame art. By the way, yeah, so if you get them on the previous stage, you can technically use them here. Technically, yes. You could. And I think I did at one stage, which is maybe why, because I broke the game. Even though, technically, if you got three from the previous stage, from the cave stage, you would be able to activate all of these get all the flame masks from them in some way. So yeah, that was one flame mask. I don't exactly know how you get... I mean, I know how to get into the back areas. There's, there's like back channels to all these places, which is how you kill these, these guys, but... Uh, then I guess it's just kind of leap of faith. You just choose which one you feel like is gonna work. Then you go over, and you save a kind of slot, because I am pretty hesitant on this, actually, to be honest. And then... Depending on which one you chose, one of them. What the heck is going on with that guy? Then it lowers. Now remember, don't jump all the way. Also, these guys coming. Just kind of wade your way through. Oh crap! I'm out. Yeah, wade through them. Can't really do anything with that, can I? Quick, grab the mana. Grab the mana. There you go. Okay, I'm safe. I, oh. Thank you, email. Appreciate it. I actually don't think I close anything. Oh, huh, you know what would be really good? If there was a death widen. How'd I see this star from outside? <laughs> Quick, get inside. Also, I just realized. What? How'd I get them attacking each other? Maybe just one bumped another. Also, you can tell how weak they are, because considering how long they're taking to get each other. Activate the thingo. Lots of these fire guys, I'll tell you that. One of them jumps into the teleporter. I can't seem to hit him from over here getting to the teleporter, it's so weird. Um, again, lots of green mana. On this hub. Ah, oh, crap. See, this is where I think, you know, you, cho you chose poorly. Because, you know, you just... Because, you know, I don't know. So none of these things are going to give me mana. I've got no mana, I've got tons of green mana. So that's the point of the ammo system in Doom. You get one weapon when you run out, then you'll have to switch to another weapon until you get more, more mana for that weapon, or ammo for that weapon. If the entire game consists of only like two mana, two types of mana, and especially because you have a weapon that will drain both of them, I mean like, unless if your entire game is designed around punching enemies, it's a little bit... Oh, on the design, if you know what I mean. 
Also, you can't, like, just walk on the start. It's so weird. Uh, so, yeah, I think... I think I had chosen this one, and then I had... gotten stuck. If you know what I mean. It's just, like... Yeah. Okay, get him. It's just, like, I went down there... There was absolutely nothing down there, and that's how I got kind of stuck, if you know what I mean. And, like, I don't know, oh, gosh. Gosh, dang it, those things. And, so I'm like, okay, well, how about I check the, the area in case if I'm missing anything, okay? So I look around for notches on the wall. There's, of course, the one that lowered the walls made the thing out. But other than that, there's nothing around. So it's like, okay, is there an item that I've got to pick up? I look around. There's still no item. By the way, this is this is what my search is normally trying to find how to do the thing. Okay, maybe there's... Tell what wasn't working for a moment. So I was like, okay, maybe there's something on the ledge, which I am, because I can walk around. I can definitely come onto this side. So it's like, okay, maybe there's something on this side of the thing? No? I'm going around, it doesn't look like there's anything. There's nothing over there, so... Yeah, this is kind of what... I end up being at. Oh, crap. I end up just reaching this kind of stage where... I don't know what to do with it. Okay, now I'm gonna, I'm gonna head back to the cave. The cave was over here. Hopefully there's some mana just lying around as well. Okay, well I guess not. Okay, now in the cave there was a doorway I believe down here. All the way down. Give you a lot of well, okay now. Okay now I believe the cave was past the Nope, I don't need you. I think it was on this side. Yeah. No, that was the cave area. Which one had the swamp? Apparently use an item just then. The warp item, yay. That was good. Um <laughs> It's kinda weird just seeing these guys just kinda casually going about their business on the ground here. Um Alright, so it's not here, because that's the only other portal. Oh no, there's another portal. Okay, we'll go oh crap. Don't get Need to get to the portal. Where is the portal? Completely walked past it. Oh, oh, no, no, I didn't. I didn't. I just <laughs> took an extreme long cut. Okay, okay. That's it. There you are. Nope. Still not in the swamp, we're in this place. Huh. Could have sworn there was a teleport to, a, to the swamp in the cave. Also, I don't, I don't remember there being wizards. Also, it's kind of odd how the wizards are the, one of the weakest enemies in the game. Also, mana. <laughs> why? Why is there like little mana on all the other maps? Again, again. Like it's so weird having not much mana in this game. 
Oh yeah, there's this little kind of cavey bit. I went into this cavey bit, didn't I? Oh, I didn't. Anyway, there's this bit with this guy. Oh, there's a couple of them there, actually. But anyway, you get a porker, porker uh, uh, it's, it's a bit of an odd secret, but okay. Also, item, 48 out of 53. That's a lot. Um... I think I kind of explained what triggers the items, but it, but I should say that since since if you're playing the game normally, like if you're playing the game without the HUD at all, then there's no point. I swear there was something in the cave area. That I swear there was like a teleport in the cave area that went somewhere. Did I seriously just completely ignore the other the other the other warp? Wow. Um, how am I gonna get out of this one? Ah. Step, step, step. I seriously just completely just ignore this warp right here. I, I apparently did. This warp goes to a completely back area in this map. Will it give us? It'll give us more enemies, I'll tell you that. Ah. Give us more things to be annoyed about. Yeah, I know. Why do I get teleported over here? Sorry, why why did I die and come back over here? Out of all places. Why did I come back here? Out of all the places. Why am I still not going the right way? Out of all places. Oh, apparently, yeah, the doorway that opens to all of these places. Also, boots. Oh, gosh. Oh, now I get teleported here. Yeah, good. Actually, you know what? Also, how many freaking enemies are there on this map? Gee, well, I can count. Bye-bye, missed. Oh yeah, here's something kind of cool. Pillars move. So you're thinking, okay, well, I'm going around. You're going, oh gosh, I want to jump there. Wow, apparently... How come these things are so effective against these guys out of all things? I can also keep whacking them while they're in there, because they're all stunned and all. There you go. Get some mana. Dragon skin braces. Yeah, that's good for the AC. It's a little bit of a weird cubby hole that's going on with this little area here. Oh yeah. And then, uh, for no reason, we we magically have, uh, you know, the bane of our existence, the thing that puts everything else to shame. <laughs> so it's like, what? Oh gosh, I accidentally put one of those down. Whoops. So yeah, you may be wondering, why do you get one now before the other weapon? That's a good point. 
Um, you can also keep going around for stuff. For some reason you can jump on it and sometimes you can't. You should be able to jump on it. Like here. Also, yeah. Yeah, what's the point of this, like, little ledge here? Why do they move? Uh, I, I don't know. I haven't answered that. Oh, crap. Also, the awkward moment of something's trying to hit you from here. Yeah! It only goes, like, halfway. <laughs> and I was like, nope, we're going back up. Now we're going all the way down. What's with that? Oh, jeez. Oh, there's another mask. I'm gonna go to... I think that was the one that we saw, actually. I'm gonna go to the other side one. Oh, but the other, the only problem with this kind of area is that there's no way to kind of exit it, specifically. Besides, you know, going back to... Also, you can go in here. We went here before, and we died. Oh, you can exit it, okay. Die, 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 you die. There you go, that worked. Oh, apparently you can't go outside. Okay, I was going like, hmm. That's a conspicuous doorway, and then it was a conspicuous doorway. Again, it's kind of odd why that would give this thing have all items. Alright, so yeah. Go on the other side. The thing I should... Oh, dude, did I activate that one? Maybe they go on a set path. That would make sense, because especially then you don't get, like, all trapped and stuff. Yep, there they go. There they go. There you go. Try and get them out of there. Oh my gosh, so many of them. So many of them. Oh gosh. Get them out of my face. Get them out of my face. Whoa, jeez, I was about... To... Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. So many. So many. So freaking many. <laughs> Don't know why I did that. gonna hit me as soon as I do. Well, that worked. Oh! Oh gosh, panic! May okay, so one that's kinda weird. Also, there's a bit of a teleport there. I remember doing this part before the other one, the one that led to a dead end, and I remember this one. No, I don't remember this one. I remember what it looks like once you've done it. If you know what I mean, like, of course. Of course, there's like a center area. Why would they be keeping it off? This is Doom. They have to fill out every single area, otherwise, it just looks unfinished. Why am I taking it out with a melee weapon? Shoot him. And then, once you kill all the enemies, then another wave comes up. Oh, actually, no. If you kill the lizard man, then another wave just comes up. So basically, don't kill too many lizard mans like what I'm doing here. Otherwise, then you just get way too many everything else. Actually, you know what? Probably take them out a bit more efficiently. Hey, got some mana as well. There's a lot of mana in this area, actually, to be honest. So, yeah. So, we got all that stuff. Now, the big question is... What do we do with all that? I mean, we go up here, we get some mana. We got the fire hands, that's good! But the other question is, where is the other... Oh, crap. Some of these guys come up. But thankfully, you know, we got fire hands. I'm cool with it. What specific ledge? Nah, I've killed too many of them. May as well just do that. So, yeah. So... Now, I may as well end off here because, one, we're on to 25 minutes. And two... 
I think we've covered considerable progress, although, yeah, this map, sump, sump, don't like it, especially because, now, we've pretty much explored, oh, we haven't explored that, the other area on the, on the side there, but, like, I don't know exactly where to go from here, so I'm going to look it up, because, I, I, I'm just stuck, because if you go here, then, did I just telefrag? Wow. Wow. Telefrag and doom. Who would see it coming? Um. So, also, apparently, we have all the weapons now. How'd that happen? <laughs> okay. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time on Hexen DD.